with your net. You're going to come all the way down. What was my first rule? No, no, get your feet wet. Feet we're wet. not getting our feet wet. So you can come all the way down to the edge, but we're not stepping in the water. And you're going to take your net. What were we supposed to do with the bottom part of our net? Scrape it. Yep, scrape it along the bottom. They are doing a macroinvertebrate um, survey of Ellen Trout Lake to see if it's a healthy ecosystem. <laughs> Look, you see these little guys crawling around in here? They made a prediction about whether or not they thought the lake was healthy or not, and then they are collecting organisms uh, to take back to the classroom to identify little macroinvertebrates, things that um, are small insects that live in the water here that support the ecosystem, and they're going to identify them and they put them in pollution tolerance categories to decide um, whether or not the lake is a um, healthy ecosystem or not. <gasps> you got a mayfly nymph! Nice job! Wow. There's nice. nothing more valuable than actually hands-on activities for the kids. Uh, lecturing in the classroom is nothing like being actually able to put your hands on it and feel it and look at it. Well, I like um, looking in the lake because you find so much interesting things and like we found like so many spiders and beetles and it's really fun. <laughs> So the first couple things in front of you are these identification guides. They are very important because um, you are going to be using them to figure out what each organism is called, okay? Oh yeah, this is an excellent learning environment for our students and the opportunity for them to come out here and get their hands dirty and have a real hands-on science survey. That's something that's a citizen science project really that can help um, our ecosystem and be able to help our environment and for them to really get this opportunity is, is really amazing. So having something here at the zoo and having this classroom space and the lake right here is really a, a vital part of making this experience happen.